Welcome to CNN, the Cougar News Network. Today is Wednesday, March 3rd, 2021. Please stand and recite the Pledge of Allegiance. Morning Cougars and teachers, welcome to day three of our nonfiction challenge for Women's History Month. So we're going to continue in the political framework and industry because these are the women who laid the foundation for us to be where we are today. So this particular lady was the wife of a former U.S. president and his name was FDR and he was president for four terms. So that means that this particular woman was the first lady for four terms. So she was the longest serving first lady in the history of the United States. Because now, presidents can only serve two terms as president. So she was a political figure and activist. She wrote a daily newspaper column called My Day. We talked about that on Monday, about how it really wasn't. Um, normal for women to write, but she had a syndicated daily news show that she wrote for called My Day. And she used her political party to advocate for child welfare, for housing reform, and equal rights for women and for minorities. In 1939, when the Daughters of the American Revolution refused to let Marian Anderson, an African-American opera singer, sing at Constitution Hall, this particular woman stood up and first of all she canceled her membership with the daughters of the american revolution and then she arranged for marion anderson to sing on the steps of the lincoln memorial and now it was an outdoor concert where 75,000 people showed up to hear marion anderson sing so these are just a few examples of how she used her political power to influence equal rights for women, for minorities, and for children. So Cougars and teachers, who is this First Lady of the United States? I look forward to your submissions. What's cooking in the Cougar Cafe? Today we will be having chicken and waffles baked beans, fresh veggies and fresh fruit, or a yogurt snacker or a chicken Caesar salad. Enjoy your lunch. It's time for a uniform check. Make sure that you're in uniform today with your shirt tucked in. And remember to follow all of the COVID-19 safety protocols. Wear your face mask inside at all times, keep your six foot distance, wash your hands and use hand sanitizer. After these messages, we'll be right back. Oh, hey! I just got to see my frisbee throwing skills. I got my frisbee from Miss Fywalski, and you can get one too for $2. She'll be selling frisbees for neon powder for the rest of the school year for $2. Get yours! Always remember to have Cougar Pride. Cougar Pride means to persevere, be respectful, have integrity, be dependable, and be encouraging. What's happening at KS? Put these dates on your calendar. Picture day is coming. On Friday, March the 5th, students with their prepaid orders will have spring pictures taken. Get ready to have your big smile on your face. (laughs) 
on Wednesday, March 10th, we will have an early dismissal day. Students will be released from school at 1215. Today is a purple day. Have a winning Wednesday.